Technology delayed is technology denied. Almost 40 aircraft in 40 years. Multiple design issues, mainly because of the engine, flight control systems. Whether these aircraft, which would be delivered in 2030, or maybe in 35, or in operationally by 2040, would be relevant in the future air warfare. There is no comparison to LCA is far, far behind the JF-17 program. This is a complex dilemma for India to decide whether to buy F-35 or not. In my opinion, there are multiple challenges associated to it. Technology delayed is technology denied. These were the words of Indian Air Force Chief A.P. Singh during one of his address last month in India. And he said it while referring to the LCA program, Light Combat Aircraft program. And he is very right on it. LC program, which was conceived in 1984, almost 40 years back, could only deliver 36 aircraft by this time. That means almost 40 aircraft in 40 years. So the purpose actually has not been achieved. The purpose of LC was to replace the aging fleet of Indian Air Force, which is MiG-21, MiG-29, Su-30, Mirage 2000. But result is that Indian Air Force squadrons are shrinking because they could not replace those aging aircraft. And as of today, uh, out of the sanction strength of 42, uh, Indian Air Force is having 31 squadrons. Although Rafael, 36 Rafael, filled the gap, and a little gap, and enhances the operational capability, but it's still far off from the ones it is compared with the regional air forces like Pakistan Air Force. The LCA program was conceived in 1984 and for that this purpose ADA, Aeronautical Development Agency was established in India for the tasking to for designing of this aircraft and for manufacturing it was given to the Hull, Hindustan Aeronautical Limited was, which was actually established in Bangalore in 1940. So they started off the work but uh, somehow because of the multiple design issues mainly because of the engine, flight control systems performance and lot of other design issues they could not achieve their aims of design although they did the first flight in 2001 but till today only 36 have aircraft have been produced delivered to indian air force and those are not even the fully operational capable aircraft foc not qualified so this is actually the frustration which indian air force chief, air force chief highlighted in his address also and then its versions lca mark 1 Mark 1A, Mark 2, then AMCA is Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft. Their timelines are also much ahead. Mark 1, only 36 aircraft have been delivered. Mark 1A, they have planned to be delivered in 2026. Mark 2, around 2028, and AMCA in 2035. Question is whether these aircraft, which would be delivered in 2030, or maybe in 35 or in operationally by 2040 would be relevant in the future air warfare in the fifth generation warfare where the aircraft air forces would be having the fifth generation stealth aircraft or maybe or will be the sixth or seventh generation aircraft and these are all fourth generation aircraft so this is uh, one of the question which i think the india should strongly consider while continue developing these aircraft Yeah, it's a very interesting comparison between the LC and JF-17. LCA, as I told you, was conceived in 1984. And after its 14 years, JF-17 was conceived in 1998. It was actually, contract was signed in 1998. LCA could not deliver it even the 40 aircraft in 40 years. And in JF-17, 150 plus aircraft are flying in the air. So if you talk about the JF-17 program, it's a highly successful program. And um, in... Uh, Conceived in 1998, got its first flight in 2003, and CL production started in 2009. And it's different variants like Block 1, Block 2, and now it's Block 3 is in air. And Block 3, its latest variant is very high-tech advanced weapon combat aircraft, having multiple capabilities, advanced avionics, internal EW, a glass cockpit, OTAS, potent uh, BVR weapons, and um, there is no comparison to LCA is far far behind the JF-17 program.